Hey everybody, I'm back with System Test 11. Uh, I've made some pretty significant changes, so we'll start in the control panel room. As you can see, I now have the panel wall mounted, and it's in the MP24 housing. And as you can see, it says Intel Alert 6802, Intel Alert Alarms, Fire and Security Products. Uh, if you look up here where there's usually a strobe, there's now a wheel lock sync module, and that is connected to a wheel lock exceeder strobe ceiling mount up here, and that's 15 candela, so that's pretty cool. Out here, I now have the wheel lock MT up here, and this is a 1575 candela mo model, and it's set to high low. And it's also connected to the sync module. Well, the strobe is anyway. And over here, I have a wheel lock RSS also connected to the sync module. This one was fixed candela, but I replaced the circuitry with a multi candela uh, strobe circuitry. And now it's multi candela and set to 15 candela for this test. Over here, I have the Ademco pull station. <laughs> And here I made a few changes. I moved the notification appliance from there to there, and this is the wheel lock NS, set to 15 candela, also uh, hooked up to the sync circuit. And down here I have the Edwards 270 SPO hooked up to zone 2. Now unfortunately this isn't working because zone 2 of my panel stopped working for some reason, so I'll be pulling the Ademco pull station. Out here, uh, I added another alarm. This is the Wheelock AMT 24 LS, and it uses the uh, LS 15 Candela strobe, and it is an AMT, which means that it has vibrating chime and three isolated inputs. So that's pretty cool. Uh, it's not hooked up to the sync circuit because the LS is not a syncable strobe. So without further ado, let's go pull the Ademco pull station. By the way, this was modeled after my elementary school system, which also uses used uh, MT set to high low, and some of them were set to code three, which is why I have the NS in the system. Okay, so here we go. Three, two, one. Okay, so that is silenced. I was trying to get a good view of the LCD screen there. Um, by the way, the one that's flashing right now is the alarm LED. I just don't have any red LEDs, so I'll have to fix that. 
But um, you can hear the sync circuit clicking, and that's uh, syncing all of the strobes except for the LS. Now, let's go look at the NS because that's doing the selective silence. So as you can see, the NS is still flashing um, despite the audible signals being turned off because it is hooked up to the sync module and the sync module is capable of doing selective silence which works for two wire horn strobes like this one. Okay, and the MT is off because it's hooked up to the uh, horn circuit. So let's reset the pull station. So that's reset. That's still flashing. And let's reset the panel. And we just press reset. And the panel is reset. That's pretty much it. Thank you for watching.